How's it going, everybody? I'm Ryan, Editor-in-Chief for PremiumBuilds.com, your one-stop shop for the latest tech news and price-to-performance optimization guides. Today, we're going to take a look at the new B550 motherboards and offer our recommendations for the five best models to pair with the new Ryzen 3000 XT CPUs. Let's begin by examining what the new B550 chipset actually has to offer. Does it deserve any of the hype, or should you just invest the extra cash for X570? While B550 pricing ended up much higher than expected, that's because these motherboards offer significant upgrades over their B450 predecessors. And with A520 still on the horizon, it's clear B550 wasn't actually intended to be a budget option. B550 is more akin to X470 and X570 than it is B450 in terms of build quality and performance, and it serves more as an option tailored to builders just looking for basic PCIe Gen 4 support. Compared to B450, B550 boards have PCIe 4 lanes to the primary PCIe and M.2 expansion slots, where the chipset link and, by extension, the general purpose lanes are PCIe 3. By contrast, B450 doesn't have PCIe 4 support at all, and unfortunately, it never will. B550 also has better overall build quality, USB support up to USB 3.2 Gen 2, much more powerful VRMs, and most importantly, guaranteed compatibility with AMD's upcoming Zen 3 processors. Whether or not B450 boards end up Zen 3 compatible is a gamble, one that may not even be worth taking at this point. Overall, B550 definitely trumps B450, and is the clear winner if you're stuck deciding between the two. So how does B550 fare against X570? Are X570 motherboards worth the extra $20 to $50 for what they offer? Not always. Despite X570's complete support for PCIe 4, there are numerous B550 options that are more than sufficient for Zen 2 and Zen 3 processors, especially for gamers that won't actually make use of the extra PCIe 4 lanes considering how expensive Gen 4 SSDs still are. So, if you see a B550 board you like, it's a safe bet to make, and one we can easily recommend for even the new Ryzen 3000 XT chips. That said, let's take a look at some of our favorite B550 options, starting with the best entry-level motherboard, the Gigabyte B550 Oros Elite. This model comes fully equipped with Gigabyte sleek Oros design, exceptional power delivery, and great connectivity for a reasonable, by B550 standards, $160 price tag. The B550 Oris Elite has a 12 plus 2 phase VRM with 50 amp power stages, support for up to 128 gigs of DDR4 4000 MHz memory, two M.2 slots, one being PCIe 4 compatible, and four SATA 6 gig ports, a Realtek ALC 1200 audio codec, which is standard for higher quality boards, as well as two USB 3.2 Gen 2 and four USB 3.2 Gen 1 ports. If you're looking to hop a board, the B550 hype train without breaking the bank, then the Gigabyte B550 Oris Elite is your best bet. Next, our pick for the best micro ATX B550 motherboard, the ASUS Tough Gaming B550M Plus Wi-Fi. If you're not interested in a full-sized ATX system, but you don't want to deal with some of the hassle of building a small form factor PC, then you're going to need an MATX board, and thankfully, ASUS has you covered. The B550M Plus Wi-Fi has 50 amp power stages on an 8 plus 2 phase VRM, support for up to 128 gigs of DDR4 4600 MHz memory, two M.2 slots, one PCIe 4, and four SATA 6 gig ports, a Realtek ALC S1200A audio codec, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth support, two USB 3.2 Gen 2 ports, one type A, one type C, and four USB 3.2 Gen 1 ports. While the Tough Gaming costs $10 more than its best competitor, the MSI MAG B550M Mortar Wi-Fi, we found that it's well worth the better memory and USB support you're getting. So, if you're in the market for a micro tower, Asus has the best option, even compared to X570. Moving on to number 3, the best mini ITX option, the Gigabyte B550i Oros Pro AX. This time, Gigabyte brings us a competitively priced and high-quality Mini-ITX B550 motherboard. It comes with a 6 plus 2 phase VRM featuring 90 amp smart power stages, support for up to 64 gigs of DDR4 4866 MHz memory, two M.2 slots, one being PCIe 4, and four SATA 6 gig ports, a Realtek ALC 1220VB audio codec, Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5.1, two USB 3.2 Gen 2 ports, one Type-A, one Type-C, and four USB 3.2 Gen 1 ports. 
At $180, the Gigabyte B550i Aorus Pro AX is a great option, especially for those looking to build a small form factor rig with something like one of the new Ryzen 3000 XT processors. For our number two spot, the highest value B550 motherboard for its price, the ASRock B550 Extreme 4. Despite being eerily similar to ASRock's other B550 options like the B550 Steel Legend or the B550 PG Velocita, the Extreme 4 strikes a wonderful balance of great looks, a plethora of features, excellent build quality, and a respectable VRM. The Extreme 4's 14-phase VRM with 50 amp power stages is complemented by support for up to 128 gigs of 4733 MHz memory, two M.2 slots, one being PCIe 4, six SATA 6 gig ports, a Realtek ALC 1220 audio codec, two USB 3.2 Gen 2 ports, one type A, one type C, two USB 3.2 Gen 1 ports, and an internal USB 3.2 Gen 1 type C header. This motherboard also has a postcode readout, an integrated rear IO shield, and onboard power and reset buttons. Now, if you must have Wi-Fi and Bluetooth support, check out the MSI MPG B550 Gaming Edge Wi-Fi, as it is also an excellent choice. With an equivalent VRM solution sporting 13 phases and 60 amp power stages, the B550 Gaming Edge Wi-Fi also includes Intel AX200 Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5.1 support. However, it does lack an integrated I.O. shield and much of the USB connectivity compared to the Extreme 4, hence why it isn't our first choice. Regardless, you can find the ASRock B550 Extreme 4 for about 185 bucks. And now, for number one on our list, the best high-performance B550 motherboard, period. The Gigabyte B550 Aorus Master. Gigabyte has made the list yet again, but our hands are pretty much tied here, as this motherboard has an absolutely incredible VRM solution for the price. In fact, its VRM is identical to their $700 Gigabyte X570 Aorus Extreme. We're talking a direct 16-phase VRM with 70 amp power stages, which puts the B550 Aorus Master in the same league as the Asus Crosshair 8 Hero and MSI X570 Godlike as well. Additionally, the B550 Aorus Master supports up to 128 gigs of DDR4 5200 MHz memory, three M.2 slots, all of which are PCIe 4 compatible, six SATA 6 gig ports, a Realtek ALC 1220VB audio codec, Intel Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth, two USB 3.2 Gen 2 ports, one type A, one type C, and four USB 3.2 Gen 1 ports. At $280, there is no better B550 option on the market, especially for those looking to make use of the higher-end AMD Ryzen 3000 XT CPUs. So, that about wraps things up. Be sure to check out our website, premiumbuilds.com, for the full article companion to this video, all of our latest coverage of the new Ryzen 3000 XT CPUs, their 10th gen Intel competition, and the upcoming generation of GPUs from Nvidia and AMD. We also regularly publish custom build guides centered around every price bracket, form factor, and component selection. Links will be in the description below. Don't forget to subscribe so you can always keep up with our latest content, drop us a like or a dislike, and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for stopping by, guys. See you next time.